Hi everybody, I'm Paul Hand. I'm a product manager here at AMX and we're inside of a testing lab here at AMX today to give an overview of the Innova DGX 16 and 32 digital media switching systems. Now, in front of me is an Innova DGX 16 and we're looking at the front of that, which it has the front control panel on it. And on the left is the Innova DGX 32 sized enclosure. Now we're gonna talk about the Innova DGX 32 today, but keep in mind, aside from the board counts, um, all of these boards are available and can be used inside of the 16 as well as the 32. The only real difference is those board counts, which has eight input or eight output boards for the 32. Well, there's only four inputs and four output boards available inside the 16. So as we look at the Innova DGX32, we see um, that there's a lot of video input and output connectors on it. So we immediately think it's an HDMI with HTCP matrix switching system. And it is. It provides us the ability to route high resolution, uncompressed video from source devices such as Blu-ray players, computers, or satellite receivers uh, throughout multiple conference rooms or even throughout an entire environment. It provides us with the flexibility of matrix switching, being able to send one source device to any or all destinations simultaneously. But it's not just an HDMI and HTCP matrix switcher. Because of uh, great features such as Instigate Pro and Smart Scale technology, we do get to ensure that all that video gets shown on all the displays without delays in environments such as sports bars or mission critical applications. But because of additional features like the Power, like the fully redundant power supplies, we make sure that that 24-7 operation capability is achieved. It's not just an HDMI with HTCP matrix switcher though. Inside every Innova DGX product family solution, there is a Netlink central control processor. And what that allows us to do is take central control and distribute it throughout an entire environment to every single endpoint with transmitted inputs and outputs from DX link input and output boards. DX link input and output boards are fed from or go to DX link transmitters and receivers. And on top of the Innova DGX enclosure are DX link transmitters and receivers. And these allow us to extend fully uncompressed HDMI with HTCP. There are some products that allow analog video as well. So we can send RGBHV, composite, component, or S video, 100 megabits of Ethernet, native Netlink central control, which is being controlled from the Innova DGX's central control processor and power from the Innova DGX central controller all over a single category cable with a 250 megahertz rating or better, which is very standard category cable. So what does it look like? If I have a single category cable, I can plug it into the input of the Innova DGX matrix. I take that category cable up to 100 meters long and I plug it into the output of the transmitter and immediately I've provided power to that transmitter. But I'm also taking that video, audio, control, 100 megabits of ethernet and I'm providing that back to the Innova DGX system and I'm now able to fully switch that video and I'm getting that control directly from the embedded central controller. So even though the Innova DGX at the heart may be a digital matrix switcher. In reality, it's much more than that. It's really the heart of the entire AV environment, providing control, power, uncompressed video, audio, uh, HDMI with HDCP, all throughout an environment and all with a single point of view. Plus with features such as or additional options such as the audio insert and extract board loaded on either the input side or the output side, we have the ability to grab hold of local audio um, from embedded HDMI lines and extract that and use that or even add local audio into uh, embedded HDMI lines. The overall product family really provides a great deal of functionality across multiple platforms, including an embedded Ethernet switch, which is inside. So a single gigabit link is able to provide uh, 100 megabits of Ethernet to every single transmitted input or output from that shared gigabit link. So not only is it a video audio control, but it's also an IP distribution solution at the same time. To find out more about the Innova DGX Digital Media Switcher product family, go to www.amx.com. Plus, check out the other videos talking about more specific product features inside the Innova DGX product family. Thanks so much for your time.